the opening week of the National Football League has finally arrived. For you as a player, what was it like when the season was about to get started? Man, it's the one time of the year, even maybe more than a Super Bowl, the butterflies are flying because you can't wait to see what's going to happen. And with that kick, a new season is upon us. He'll have a chance to take off. And it's the same as a touchback as he's tackled right at the 20. week of the NFL season is underway and it's Rolando McLean who makes the stop nice job that time by the tight end makes the catch and you got to look out for him now in the NFL remember they're usually the closest receiver to the quarterback the quarterback gets in trouble he's going to look for the tight end going back to the air on this play. The reception by Adams. Corner route's not thrown enough in this league anymore. A lot of teams don't do it because it takes a strong arm quarterback to get it done. That was a terrific throw up the field that time. First down, offense readying for the snap. This play set up by the long gainer. And Rodgers will hand it off. Brought down at the 20. Here's a look at the offense. And this core group of wide receivers must find a way to get open today. And here we have second down. Lacey, a solo back set. Randall Cobb has the reception. That's a gain of 10. You got to be able to adjust when you run these drag routes across the field. The throw cannot always be right on target. Can you reach behind, make the catch, and keep going full speed? That's the sign of a good receiver. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Brings it in for the score in the end zone. What a way to start the year. The opening drive of the season for your football team, and what do you do? You march right down the field and score a touchdown. All that work in training camp, it all came to just, it melded right together. You made it happen, exciting stuff makes the PAT. The Cowboys will take the snap from the 25. On the money. It's wide open. 
open on his way. Clinton Dix there to make the tackle. It is hard to make a tackle from behind out there in open space with the speed of all these guys in the NFL, but a good job that time by the defense making that tackle. Breaking huddle at the eight-yard line. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. For about four. Here's a look at the offense. And if they're going to win today, this group of wide receivers must go vertical. They must open up the game for the offense. Ready to take the snap at the four. Let's go. Second and goal from the four. And he gains maybe three. This will be interesting to see how the defense plays this situation. They're up a touchdown. Will they be aggressive or play it safe? I know one thing. If they give up three points, they'll be very happy. Only a yard from the end zone. The defense loading up on the line, getting set for this snap. He breaks the play. He's in for the touchdown. And that's a nice recovery after falling behind early, tying the game here just midway through the first quarter. You know, Jim, when you fall behind early in football games, it can be a little unsettling because you go, oh, no, here we go. We're always behind. But, hey, that touchdown, that's going to change their frame of mind and emotionally going to lift them up should help their play. The point after is good. The Cowboys are ready to kick it away. Fields the football at the three. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. The Packers ready to get this drive started. The last time they had it, Phil, it was a touchdown and they got all the way to the end zone mainly through the air. Yeah, they did it through the air. They got good protection. You know, we love what the quarterback is doing, but how about the wide receivers and everybody catching the football, separating from the defender, and they're getting some easy throw and catches out there. The Packers will take the snap from the 25. Brought down at the 26. As we get a look at the defensive starters, these linebackers will be counted on today to make plays in the running and passing games. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Double tight end formation. Got hit on release. Third down now. The Cowboys will come out in the dime. From the gun, Rodgers. 
the Packers now move the chains. The Packers put themselves in a terrible situation. Third long, but you know what? They've got a lot of talent on the offensive side, and that was an awesome job of picking up that first down. First down here after the completion. Rodgers standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Rodgers there to catch the ball that had a lot of heat on it. to the line at the 45. Now first and ten. Hand off made. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. Ends up picking up four. Lacey is a dangerous runner when you give him room to run, but there is no room this time. What a job by the defense. They bottle him up for a short game. It'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Lacey, a solo back set. Underneath, but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete. Breaking huddle coming to the line at the 42. The Cowboys defense now loading up, expecting pass with a dime defense. Third and six. Ball is out, and the recovery is made by the defense. It's plain and simple. If you want to stay in the game, you got to hold on to the football. That time, that fumble, that was careless. Keep those hands wrapped around it when the defenders are getting ready to hit you. in the pistol. First down at the 32. It's Witten. That's a gain of eight. The Cowboys did a good job there on first down. That pass picks up some good solid yards. Now second is short. Much easier to call those kind of plays. To that grab it's now second down and two out of the eye here's the handoff and he's brought down right at the 42 as we take a look at the defense for the first time today these starters in the secondary will be challenged today in both the passing and running games
Now third and short following the run. Michael, the lone setback this time. Got a flag. He's taken down at the 42. The defense, a little jumpy right there. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. First and ten. Toss to the outside. The Cowboys will take the snap from the 45. And Perry in on the tackle. You know, Jim, it's been a long time, but when I played that was third and long early in the game, I knew the defense was going to be very careful. So I was already thinking, if I don't like it down the field, I'm going to throw it short and do it quickly. And it's third and ten here after the run. The Cowboys need to get to the 43 to pick up a first. Romo's got it in the gun. The catch is made. No one's going to get him now. Nobody was going to catch him there. Touchdown. Nice catch by the rookie wide receiver. And how about that? His first receiving touchdown in the NFL. He is so talented. There is no doubt he's going to have a lot more. He made it. The Packers are back deep, ready to return. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. The Packers are set to take the field again on offense after a crazy sequence that didn't go their way. That turnover led to turnover points. And now let's see if the offense can get that back, Phil. Yeah, listen, I know they're going to be motivated because after they turned the football over last time, the coaches took them to the sideline and just gave them heck. That's for sure. That's a good way of seeing it. So motivation, can't make those kind of mistakes. You've got to go out there and be much better. Take it from the 23. Out of the eye. It's Lacey. That's a gain of six. Well, he's in the NFL because of this. Because this guy can break tackles. Good job on that play. Second and four following the run. now in the NFL. It wasn't like that when I played. We didn't have guys that could go up and make catches like that. Lacey, a solo back set. First down at the 43. Rodgers over to Nelson. Defense. 
That little throw was good for only three, so it's now second down and seven. Knighton with the sack. Of course, when you get blindsided, especially nowadays in this league where they do everything they can to make sure that quarterback doesn't get hit, that's devastating to take that kind of hit. It'll be third down. The Packers still driving as the second quarter gets underway. On the way, third down. The Cowboys go with the dime formation here on defense. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Good job by the defense. Staying in the right spots. They give up the short pass. They make the tackle. And now we have fourth down coming up. All set to punt here. No chance to return this one as that punt is headed to the sidelines. The Cowboys offense, Phil, is on a roll right now with touchdowns coming on each of their last two possessions. Can they make it three in a row right here? Well, we're going to find out. I like their chances. What have we seen that makes us think that they're not going to come out there and get it done? They're, they're playing exceptional football on the offensive side. The lone setback this time. The Cowboys from the 32. Tony Romo uncorks the long pass. Touchdown! Another touchdown early in the second quarter. And, Phil, we met with this team and the coaches. Did you have any idea they were going to come out with this kind of start? No, I didn't, Jim. They're doing a terrific job on the offensive side and scoring those points. I, I love what they're doing on the defensive side. Hey, when it's not working, you know what you do? You change game plans. That's what I want to see from the defense. The Cowboys setting up for the kickoff. And a flag comes out. Grabbing the face mask. We see it almost once a week, and here it happens again. Well, a lot of times these defenders, I'll give them a, you know, a little slack because they're Running so fast, they're trying to tackle some tremendous athletes in open space, and sometimes, accidentally, you're going to grab the face mask. The Cowboys' defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. First down at the 40. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. He's averaging about three yards a carry on the day. It's now second down. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. And he comes down. No, the defender tips it out. Well, the quarterback that time tried to squeeze it into tight coverage, but no can do. The coverage is too good, and the football falls incomplete. Third and six coming up.
The Packers have it at the 44. Adams has got it on a pass that had some heat. the 33 after the long game let's see what they do here they'll run it here and Hardy in on the tackle well you can't knock them all down and sometimes the running back has just got to break a tackle good job that time the 28. Three nine, three. Three nine, three. Second down and five. They feed it to him one more time. Then picks up about three. Lacey is never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. Just 25 yards to pay dirt. Third down and two. They hand it off to him again. And he's tackled down after picking up the first. Lacey is able to get it done that time. Why? Because he has the power and the will to make it happen. Third short, he just gets it done with sheer willpower. Only 20 yards to the end zone. The Packers load up the backfield for this next play. Eddie Lacy makes the catch. yard line Aaron Rodgers back off the line shotgun formation Rodgers going to take the snap from the shotgun and intercepted you got to stay aggressive on the defensive side that time the defense did even though the offense was going in to score they finally they come up with the big play and they get the interception inside their own 20 yard line Tough starting field position here. Michael lined up in the backfield. Throws the pass. And that's a gain of 10. That's his first reception today. When you're backed up against your own end zone, I think it's up to the coach to call some plays that catches the defense by surprise. They did it that time, and they got a big first down. Romo's five for five after that completion. First down and ten. They'll go ground. And that's a gain of nine. He's averaging about three yards a carry on the day. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Second and short following the run. Finds his mark. That's a gain of 10. The Cowboys are looking good so far, Phil, and a lot of that has to do with the passing game. 
Romo's been on the mark to this point. He has. He's one of the better throwers in the NFL. When you give him time, like he's had here so far today, he is going to put it right on target. Two tight ends on the field here. Hand off by Romo. And it's Clay Matthews in on the play. Michaels trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. Let's go. The catch is made by Witten. Witten's met at the 37. The Cowboys do a really good job this time on offense. The quarterback throws the ball short. They pick up a few yards, and now it makes third down much easier. Romo's now completed his last seven passes. And the offense will need three yards here on third down after the completion. Looks like they're in press coverage here. Play number six coming up on this drive. Romo's going to throw once again on this down. Romo connects with Williams. That's his first reception today. The Cowboys have been awesome today on first down. That time it's a nice play design. They throw the football, picks up solid yards, second and short. Boy, that's what every offense likes to be in. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. The Cowboys snap it at the 41. Picked up a couple that time. Randall's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. They're able to move the chains after that last run. The Cowboys have it at the 39. And over to Witten. Witten's tackled down at the 29. Cowboys coaching staff has done a good job of mixing things up today on first down. The pass catches the defense off guard. They pick up solid yards. Now it's second and short. Second down after that pass play. Johnson's got it on a pass, had some heat on it. The offense picks up another first down and extends this drive. They are, Jim, they're marching down the field, and I give all the credit to the offensive line. They are dominating the defense right now. This drive now about to reach the 10th play of the series. And now we reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. Can the defense make a stop? The Bent a lot here in this drive. They had the offense backed up. They let them march down the field. Now you're in the red zone. Make the right call and stop them. They're just grinding away down here, inching closer to the end zone. Well, that's what you got to do sometimes. It's hard always to think that you're going to come out and just make big plays. You've got to do the dirty work, and this offense is doing it right now. 
This long drive continues. Second and goal from the three. He's averaged about two yards a carry on the day. And the defense will use one of its timeouts right here. Play number 12 coming up for the offense. Third and goal from the three. And that picks up three. Big decision for the coach this time, Jim. You fail on third and goal. What do you do? Do you go for it? I say you call the play and you try to put up seven points. Should be what we call a gimme. The kick is good. How important was it, Phil, to add another three to the lead before the intermission? And you got to look at the team that's trailing right now. You got to go in at halftime and change what you're doing because what you've been doing so far, it hasn't worked. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21 the Packers just gave up some big turnover points let's see if they can hold on the football this time Phil because we know how crucial it is we talked to the coaches about it this week this was their concern with this team well if you want to stay on the field you better quit turning it over right Jim that's what they the coaches look you you make mistakes on the field they're going to get they're going to be forgiving to a point but you got to be smart you got to be efficient and get the job done first down at the 21 the reception by Lacey. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up, and when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. Second down and six. He'll throw it over the middle. Fights through contact, and they tackle him there at the 34. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down, Jim. That's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. At the 34, 66 yards from pay dirt. The Cowboys with two extra defensive backs in the dime. First down at the 34. Looking to go down the field here. Rodgers back in shotgun formation. Nelson had it, but couldn't hold on as this goes incomplete. Well, I think it's important for the defense. Anytime it's a third and long situation for the offense to know where those first down markers are, give a little ground, and make sure you're able to come up and make the tackle short of the first down marker. Third down on the way. Quarters formation here for the defense. Rodgers going to take it from the gun. Almost intercepted. The Packers don't have a lot of options on third and long situations. The pass goes incomplete, and the defense did a good job of staying back there and not giving up the deep throw. It'll be interesting to see after that fumble by the kick return team, will we still have the same returner when they come back out of the field? I don't think so. That was a big mistake. I think they need a replacement. The Cowboys back onto the field now to get another drive started. They came away with a field goal in their last possession, Phil, but had to be a letdown because they were really moving the football. Oh, I think you're right. They had to be let down. You, you execute so many good plays going down the field, and you just need that one to get you in the end zone. They did not do that. So, Jim, I think you're right. I think they were a little down about that field goal.
The first half is complete. Larry Ridley is ready to take things over back in our studios. And you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Crosby ready now for the second half kickoff. The second half has officially started, and are we going to see a big-time comeback? And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. The Cowboys' offense takes the field. Let's see if this momentum can carry over from the first half because they have been brilliant to this point, partner. Yeah, a lot of things change in that locker room at halftime. You know, you you might feel good about what you've done. And of course, you got to realize the defense might be upset and is willing to come out here and take more chances in the second half. Let's go. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. There is a flag out. Boy, if his head got yanked back the other way, an obvious face mask penalty, and that's a big one. It's about safety of the players, too. That's why when you grab, hit the helmet in certain situations, it's going to be a 15-yard penalty. Don't grab the face mask. First down at the 40. Randall's going to secure the handoff. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. After running it, it's second down. Michael, the lone setback this time. And Hayward nearly had the pick. Incompletion by the quarterback that time. It was good, tight, man-to-man -man coverage. After the incompletion, third and four coming up. The Packers' defense now is going to go nickel. Look out, they're changing the play to take advantage of something they see on the defensive side. There's the offense picking up another first down on third down. I think the coach on the sidelines, he's going to be happy with every first down because he knows that's more time off the clock. When you're up like this, multiple scores in the second half, every first down just puts the odds in your favor of winning this game. Romo's completion percentage, 90% on the day. Set up now at the 39-yard line. The Cowboys have it at the 39. And they bring him down at the 38-yard line. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. Toss to the outside. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. Michael is a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances.
Coming to the line at the 27. Michael lined up in the backfield. Draw. And Daniels is all over that offense and brings him down. Packers defensive coordinator, my gosh, he is one happy guy. Anytime you get in the backfield and stop a runner and make him lose yards, that's some good stuff. Snapping the football from the 28. Romo set in the pistol. The Cowboys take it from the 28. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. Well, Jim Nance, even you could coach the team in a situation like this. You're winning big. It's third long. You know what you do? You hand the football off and you punt the football. Third down. The Packers lined up in the nickel. From the gun, Romo. This will go incomplete. He was trying to find Williams. The Cowboys put themselves in a situation where the defense has all the advantage. They know the pass probably has to go down the field on third and long, and they were ready for it. Bailey's lining up for the field goal. He's one for one so far today. The kick is good. And they're on the board just moments into the second half with a field goal. And I'm sure that's the kind of start they had in mind. Well, sure it was. Good job by the offense. But I'm looking at the defense. My gosh. What did you guys do at halftime? Just sit around and sip some hot cocoa? No return here as he takes a knee in the end zone. The Packers talked things over at the intermission, and I'm sure one of the first orders of business was to try to figure out a way to get this offense going, Phil. Absolutely. That's what you want to do, and I think you do that by play call. So the coach, they have many plays that we call drive starters. Catch the defense by a surprise. They need to call one of those right here and right now to get this offense going. First down at the 20. Rodgers sends it to Cobb. The post route, deep down the field, going towards the goal post. It's not called enough in this league. Nice throw by the quarterback. lines up in the backfield. Lacey, a solo back set. He's hit as he throws it. That was an incomplete pass that time against cover two, the two deep safeties, and you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that, and that's why it was incomplete. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. The Packers get a first down. Hard to guard these tight ends now in the NFL. It really puts the defense in like a quandary. Do we use a big guy? Well, the big guy's not fast enough. We use a small guy? Well, he's not big enough. They get pushed around. I don't know what you're going to do. Just make sure you're a good tackler after they catch him. The football just inside the 40 at the 39. The Cowboys with a nickel look here on defense. First down at the 39. Knocked down as he fires it.
advancing it now inside the 40. Second and 10 to the ground. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stopped him for a short game. It's third down coming up. Aaron Rodgers going to take it from the shotgun. Eddie Lacy makes the catch. Game 17. The backers on their offensive play sheet, they don't have many plays for third and long situations, but that is a really nice job that time by the offense, the quarterback. They pick up the first down. That'll get you going. First and 10. Quick screen to Cobb. Lee's all over the ball carrier. Well, we see it more and more. Football's thrown behind the line of scrimmage. They do it that time. Nice catch, but a loss of yards on the play. Here they come to the line of scrimmage, the 21-yard line. The Cowboys come out in a dime package. Second down and 11. And straight ahead, Lacey. That hit by Sean Lee. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Jim, when you get inside the other team's red zone, inside the 20-yard line, and you're down some points, you're thinking touchdown in these situations. Third and two. Gets it again. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. And this fires the football team up. The defense, third and short. They stop the run, keeps the offense short of the first down, and look at the excitement on the defensive side. The kick is good. Well, it was a beautiful drive down the field. Long drive by the offense. They do not get the seven points, but they're fortunate. They do get the field goal try, and they make it. Still not taken down. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. The Cowboys put some points on the board on their previous possession. Although it was just the field goal, Phil, they'll be looking to add some more right here. Oh, absolutely. I think they were disappointed in that last drive. You got it going. You think here comes a touchdown and it doesn't work and you kick a field goal. So a little disappointed. That should give them some momentum to get tougher and make this happen and get a touchdown. Shotgun look here for Tony Romo. Romo standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Beasley's tackled down at the 32. The Cowboys have created chances for themselves in the passing attack today. Romo's been unstoppable so far. He has been unstoppable, hasn't he? When your quarterback is hot, keep giving the football to him. They've done it and he has rewarded the coaches. After that grab, it's now second down and two. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. And they get to him at the 45. He's averaging about four yards a carry. Boys will take the snap from the 45. Randall's taken down at the 49. Randall's a dangerous runner when you give him room to run, but there is no room this time. What a job by the defense. They bottle him up for a short game.
They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Michael lined up in the backfield. The Cowboys now move the chains. Setting up now at the 44 yard line. Let's go. First down at the 44. Randall's marked down after a gain of nine. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Second and short following the run. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. The give out of the eye. That's a gain of six. Michael's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. Lined up in the backfield. Now first and ten. Clinton Dix there that time for the tackle. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. The Cowboys will come to the line trying to put together a scoring drive here in the fourth. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Another handoff right back to him. Clinton Dix there to make the stop. Michael's a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. Here they come to the line of scrimmage at the 12. First and 10. Another running play. Burnett's the one who brings them to the ground. The Cowboys, they believe in their offense. They know once they get inside the red zone, they can run or throw. That time they run the football, and it picks up some good solid yards. Great job by the offensive line. Just four yards away from the end zone. Ready to make the stop on the goal line. Loading up that defensive front. They call his number once more. is play number 10 on this drive. Let's go. The Cowboys with a little uncertainty, so they take a timeout here before third down.
What a drive this has been. Quick drop back. Wittens throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. Hard to cover these tight ends when they get into the end zone because they're fast, they're nimble, and they're big. So even if you cover them, they push off and get the touchdown catches. The Packers are back deep, ready to return. Just past the 20 will mark it at the 22 yard line. The Packers retake the field on offense. They just piled up the yardage the last time they had it, but walked away with only three. Yeah, but you got to feel good about it. They, they had a long march. They did a lot of good things on the offensive side. The offensive line performed well. And to march the football that far and kick a field goal, you got to feel good about it. They bring in the extra tight end. First down at the 22. Throws it toward the sideline. What a catch. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done then. That time, quarterback had time. He throws it down the field for another completion. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Lacey, a solo back set. Here's the handoff. And that'll be a gain of about two. Now as we look at the numbers, Phil, this offense just hasn't had any room to run the football today. And that's a big reason why they're down in this game. Yeah, you, listen, I think they've been too patient today trying to run the football too much. Just get over it. Go ahead. Try to win the football game by throwing it down the field. Second down after... Going to the ground game, the first play. 319! 319! Pass is made, but the hit knocks the ball out. Incomplete. Boy, that was some hit that time that knocked the ball out. Yeah, it was a good hit, but listen, you can tell the receivers expecting that big hit. I don't know why. You're going to get hit no matter what, so you might as well just go ahead and catch the football. This is third down. Rodgers got it in the gun. Devontae Adams has it. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. The Packers will go for it here on fourth down and a short yardage situation. Rodgers going to take the snap from the shotgun. The Packers turn the ball over on downs. The Packers decided to go for it on fourth down that time, and uh, hey, it didn't pay off. And of course, the coach, look at him now. He is second-guessing his decision. The Cowboys will be trying to make it three successful drives in a row as they retake the field here on offense, partner. they got a great feeling from the offense so far. In other words, they're confident. They feel good, so you need to keep calling plays. They keep the, the offensive players in a positive frame of mind. You do that, hey, I wouldn't be surprised to see him march down here and score again. Up the gut here. And Perry in on the tackle. Randall's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. The ball is spotted at the 49. Unable to beat the down clock, and that'll cost him five yards, a delay of game.
Second down and nine. Randall's going to take the handoff now. Now looking at third down. A timeout charged to the offensive unit. Third down now. Third and 12. Hand off. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. The Cowboys decide to go for a run here on third and long. And look, not second guessing that play call. Not fitting the playbook. In the passing game, they're going to pick up the first down. They go with the run. The defense is not fooled. And now they're going to have to punt. The Cowboys are going to punt the football. it and it's going to sail out of bounds trying to play kick away from that dangerous returner Rodgers will be under center. First down at the 16. He's got the catch. Montgomery's tackled down at the 22. That's his first reception today. That was a nice reception, but not enough for the first down. Second down coming up. Lacey lines up in the backfield. There's a drop. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. It'll be third down. The Cowboys sat at the line. Dime package. Makes the catch. Montgomery's tackled right at the 28. What we saw there was probably the number one route all teams work on when they go to training camp. The curl route. Find the open space in the defense. Quarterback throws it in there. Good job. The Packers all bunched up here as they get set at the line. And it's batted down. Second down after the incompletion. Lacey, a solo back set. A nice grab. No doubt he was going to hold on to that one. down here the offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion pass is intercepted tackles made midway through the fourth and the mood on that sideline Phil has to be one of tremendous frustration as they throw the interception 
Absolutely, Jim. They have to be so disappointed. They had high hopes coming into this game. We talked to the coaches. They thought they would play well. Well, this is just one of those days when nothing went right for your side. They'll go ground. Tackle down at the 42-yard line. football sits at the 42 yard line it's a two tight end formation gets the handle here he's tackled beyond the markers it's a first down he's averaging five yards per carry on the day down at the 33 picks up eight here always good to have these types of runs yeah, it's not a first down but it sends a message it shows everybody that you can run it when you want to and also it opens up so many other things for your offense scrimmage the 25 yard line Get ready. Ready. second and three they call his name again tackles made and the first down is picked up running the football is a mindset and it's one this team has today for sure you can tell this was the thought process all week long by the offense. We're going to go out there. We're going to out-tough the other team and just run the football right at them. And it has worked well. Breaking huddle at the 21. Two minutes to go in the second half. First down at the 21. He runs with it right up the gut. Randall's met at the 16. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Randall's handed the football. The Cowboys get a first down. Well, that's just the right call to make in this situation. Just run the football. Don't try to be some genius and catch the defense off guard. Manage the clock and just get this game over with. Takes an eight. Nothing like winning that opening game of the season, Phil. It really is, Jim, winning week one in the NFL. All the hard work. You put it out in the field. You're not sure what your team is going to do. And then you go out there and you win. Man, you get to sit back and really enjoy it.
So for Bill Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now.